out a new sponsor to Health Blaze. All the information is in the description. Use the promo code above. Good filler one boxing at 18% off of all their natural products from deodorant, pomade, toothpaste, and much, much more. And they have additional discounts on their website as well. That's the healthblaze.com. Start December 20th. That promo code is good for 18% off. We go. All right. Earl Spence tweeted out today that he, he promised it's going to happen. And most people are alluding to the fact that he promises that he's going to fight Terrence Crawford. He could just went on and, and dropped a hundred ball on it, put a hundred and say, I'm going to go ahead and fight Terrence Crawford, put his name on it, man. But I appreciate everybody for coming in. Good fellow sports TV. One time for the one time we grinding. And that's what we want to hear. You know what I'm saying? We want to hear you promise that we want to hear that for sure, for sure. You're going to make it happen because when you get your word out there and if that's what he was talking about, even though his cop, I was promising something else. But if you, you know, if he really was saying, I promise I'll make this Terrence Crawford shit happen, it's going to happen, you know, then that's your word. And if it don't happen, for whatever reason it don't, unless you got proof that they didn't want it to happen or Crawford, you know, got injured or he lost or whatever the, may, whatever the obstacle may be, okay, we understand. But if it come out that you still undefeated, he's still undefeated, and it don't happen, well, it fall in your hand. That's your word. And um, your word is your reputation. And people kept sending me this tweet, it's going to happen, I promise with a shark so at the end of the day the way i look at it man is that if you really want to fight sometimes you got to compromise sometimes you got to take two steps back to get five or seven or ten steps forward you know floyd mayweather took an 80 20 split versus oscar de la hoya took the bull by the horns and he went on to make you know shit hundreds millions down there grossing a billion dollars you know what i'm saying and that's because he took a back seat to oscar de la hoya and if you really want something to happen sometimes you got to compromise you know, and take a few steps back to go forward, to take money to make money. You know what I'm saying? And sometimes you got to lose to win, and a lot of people won't understand that. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people think you're supposed to win all that life, but taking losses is about, it is life. You know what I'm saying? Even if it's financial or physically or, or mentally you lose it, and then you feel like, and you rebuild, you rebuild off of that, come back bigger, stronger, and quicker and faster. You know what I'm saying? That's what lo- losing about, man. It's a loss. You know what I'm saying? And at the same time with him, it's okay if you, you lose a couple of dollars versus Terrence Crawford's when I'm alluding to. It's okay if you got you to gotta give him 50-50 or, you know, you got to take a 60-40 split in your favor. You know what I'm saying? And, let, and you feel like you got three belts, you deserve a 70-30 or 80-20. You know, but it is what it is. You know, you know to assure people, this is all I want to hear. You're going to fight the dude, fight him, all right. You know, you promise you're going to make it happen. In my opinion, I look at it as, Everything in his power, he going to make it happen. It's the same promise he gave to his kids, you know, to protect them and to make sure they good and had the best schooling and had the best food and everything else they need to have. That's how I look at it. Keep that promise, bro. You know, and that's going to be, and if he don't keep that promise, you know, and it turns out it's his fault or it's not clearly Terrence Crawford's fault, then it's going to be detrimental in his career. By him saying, I promise it's going to happen, you know, he must be feeling some heat. But at the end of the day, you know, I believe it when I see it, but I but I I have no reason not to believe Earl Spence's word. You know, I think he's he, he holds himself with dignity with with some type of integrity. So I believe he gonna make it happen. You know, at least he gonna do his part. We know you know you're dealing with Bob, it's tough because you will never know. You know, he said he wants to fight one day and he willing to make the fight. Then by the time you want to make the fight, he don't want to make it no more. So with Earl Spence, we'll see, man. Um glad to had that had that assurance from him. And I have no reason not to believe that he won't make this fight happen. I have no reason not to believe. He hasn't shown me to be a liar or nothing like that as far as his word in boxing. So, shit, hopefully the fight happen. If it don't, hey, big fucking deal. You know, if it don't, just come out and say, all right, it's not going to happen because of the business side. But hopefully it does happen. Um, uh, it's, a, it's a fight for the, not just for the boxing, but for black people, man. For the black fight fans, we deserve a fight like this, man. To you know, not have to put a, not have a, a Mexican put us on a pedestal, or pulling our fighters on the pedestal and resp- be responsible for our, for for one of our fighters' uh, growth or popularity in the sport. How about two black fighters put each other on, and do a classic fight that I believe that's gonna live up to the hype, and exceed the hype in my opinion. So shout out to uh, Errol Spence and by, by telling us it's gonna happen. And uh, putting his name on it and stop approval, we're going to hold you to that, homie. And hopefully it does happen, man. Hopefully, you know, you understand that sometimes you got to compromise to get what you want. Sometimes you got to compromise for legacy. And he was talking to Floyd tonight. And uh, 
You know, hopefully, you know, that's something that he can learn from Floyd. Everybody look at the pageantry and the, the jewelry and shit, but that took him taking a 2080 split to Oscar De La Hoya. But don't forget, we on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can reach out to the email as well. All those links in the description if you need to reach out to me. Don't forget, check out our sponsor, The Hellblaze, at TheHellblaze.com. Promo code goodfellow one boxing 100% all-natural products. Get 18% off of the products with my promo code. We gone.